So I decided to get the Cinderella lift because I'm 45 now, nearly 46, and I had just started to feel like, oh, we're getting some jowls here. Um, and I'm not adverse at all to, if something's broken, then fix it. It doesn't bother me. Um, and so many people I know have been to the Harley Street Skin Clinic and told me about this, this Cinderella lift and how quick and easy it was. So I thought, you know what? So I just looked into it and I couldn't believe how cheap it was. So I was like, what have I got to lose? So I went in and in half an hour, I walked out with my entire jawline back. Um, I had gotten very sort of with the long hair and I was hiding it a lot. Um, so it was just like, a, I just thought, you know what, just do something about this because I, I actually wanted the haircut for a long time but didn't because of Jowly McJowl, which is now gone. I didn't do any deliberating before making the decision because a lot of people I know had had the same treatment and I know Harley Street Skin Clinic very well. Um, I trust them. I know that they're they're probably the best out there. So there was no hesitation on that front at all. Um, no. And also, I didn't want anything extreme. I didn't want like a facelift. I wanted something natural and minimal and, and with minimum invasion of the skin, which it was. So for me, it was a no brainer. So I had this done. Um, just before I started Panto, which is ironic because it's called the Cinderella Lift. So my friends have all said it's like Cinderella really has waved her magic wand over my face and ta-da! But I had it, it must have been about six weeks ago now. And as you can see, it's still, I'm, I'm completely obsessed with going, I look 10 years younger. Um, and I took a picture in to the Harley Street Skin Clinic of myself, so I'm 45 now, I took a picture in of myself, age, I must have been about 30, 35, because what I wanted was not anything new and enhanced, I wanted to look nearer to how I looked then. And, uh, and this is honestly the jawline that I had then, so I, I just think it's amazing, really. So the procedure's really easy. Um, I think with any procedure like this, people get nervous and you don't know what to expect. Um, I wasn't, like I said, I know the clinic well. I know, you know, so many people that have had brilliant stuff done there. So I wasn't nervous. Um, it took about half an hour after I'd had my face numbed. Um, it didn't hurt. I couldn't feel anything. I had local anaesthetic in my face. I actually started to fall asleep at one point. <laughs> Um, and within half an hour, I was sat up with a mirror and went, oh my God, wow. Like it's that quick, it's really, really quite unbelievable how um, you do not need to go into hospital and have a full facelift and bandages. I mean, it was lay down, treatment, sit up, wow. So recovery wise, there is none really. I mean, there is, but there isn't. You've got to be careful for a couple of days. But honestly, I had no swelling. I had a tiny bit of tenderness, obviously, because you've had the threads put in to your face. So obviously, there's going to be a bit of tenderness. I had no other downtime at all, which is also why I'd never want a facelift. There's bandages involved. There's lots of downtime involved. This was honestly in and out. The only way it's really changed my life is that my hair sounds so ridiculous. I really wanted my hair cut short. And now I can. And I know it sounds really vain, but we all have our own random insecurities, don't we? And mine really was. Also, I have a, a scar which was well documented on EastEnders as being something that Ronnie did to me, but it's not. It's something my brother did to me playing. Um, so because of the scar and Jowl's beginning, I was just really getting weird. So it's changed my life in that way. Um, and also, just so many people keep coming up to me and saying, you look really well, but they can't quite put their finger on what it is. And me being me, just says, yeah, I've had a Cinderella lift. I am absolutely not um, uh, the sort of person to say no to any other surgery. I truly believe if something needs fixing or can be restored to look a way it did before, and you can do it, why not? I don't believe in having 
ridiculous amounts of surgery or work where you look, oh, I really believe in a very natural look and any other work I ever have in the future, which I'm sure I will, I always, always go in specifying, please can we like, you know, not go mad and look as natural as possible.